Vinayaka Krishna Gokak the 9th of August 1909 to the 28th of April 1992 was a major writer in the Kannada language and a scholar of English and Kannada literatures. He was the fifth writer to be honored with the Jnanpith Award in 1990 for Kannada language for his epic Bharatha Sindhu Rashmi. Bharatha Sindhu Rashmi deals with the Vedic age and is perhaps the longest epic narrative in any language in the 20th century. In 1961, Gokak was awarded the Padma Shri from the Government of India for Dayava Prithvi. Academic life Gokak was born on 9 August 1909 to Sundarabhai and Krishna Rao. He was educated in Majid High School, Savanur, and attended the Karnatak College Darwar, where he studied literature. He was later awarded first class honours by the University of Oxford. On his return from Oxford in 1938, he became the principal of Willingdon College, Sangli. He was principal of Rajaram College, Kolhapur, Maharashtra from 1950 to 1952. Between 1983 and 1987, he served as the president of the Sahitya Akademi. He also served as the director of Indian Institute of Advanced Study, Shimla, and the Central Institute of English, Hyderabad. He was an ardent devotee of the spiritual guru Sathya Sai Baba and served as the first vice chancellor of Sri Sathya Sai Institute of Higher Learning, Puta Parthi, between 1981 and 1985, after a stint with the Bangalore University. His novel Samarasave Jivana is considered one of the typical works of Navadaya literature in Kannada. Literary career and success Gokak was a prolific writer in both Kannada and English. He was deeply influenced by the Kannada poet D. R. Bendra who mentored him during his early forays into Kannada literature. Bendra is reputed to have said that were Gokak to allow his talent to bloom in Kannada, there was a bright future in wait for Gokak in Kannada literature. His epic Bharatha Sindorashmi, running into 35,000 lines, is notably the longest epic written in this century, for which he received the Jnanpith Award and also honorary doctorates from Karnataka University and Pacific University, USA. His novel Samarasave Jivana was translated by his daughter Yashodhara Bhatt into English under the title The Agony and the Ecstasy and released to worldwide popularity. In the 1980s, Karnataka was in the midst of an agitation which demanded the replacement of Sanskrit with Kannada as the medium of instruction in schools. V. K. Gokak also headed the Gokak Committee, which recommended declaring Kannada as the first language in schools in the state. Gokak's writing reflected his interest in religion, philosophy, education, and cultures. His education abroad prompted him to write two sets of travelogues. The Navadaya movement was at its peak and Gokak stayed true to his spirit his poems showed nuances of Victorian poetry, oral traditions in Kannada storytelling and epics in Sanskrit and Kannada. V. K. Gokak wrote many collections of poetry under the pen name Vinayaka. These collections include Samudra Jithagalu, Baladeguladali, Abudaya, Dayava Prithvi, and Ernaba. Gokak's anthology of poetry by Indian poets titled The Golden Treasury of Indo-Anglican Poetry was a treatise on poets like Sri Aurobindo, Sarojini Naidu and Toru Dutta, Nisim Ezekiel and Kamala Das. In the late 1960s he was deeply influenced by Sri Sathya Sai Baba of Puttaparthi and over the years, Gokak became the medium for translating the Guru's words into English and spreading it to the world. His book The Advent of Sathya Sai explains the meaning of Sathya Sai Baba's miracles, his work with the poor and his impact on the educational system. The state of Karnataka hosts a series of literary events to mark Gokak's birth centenary on 9 August of every year. Writings <laughs> 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 Topic. Epics Bharatha Sindhu Rashmi Topic. Novels Samarasave Jivana, Ijodu Matu Aralita Volume 1 Samarasave Jivana, Samudrayana Matu Nirvahana Volume 2 Topic. 
Poetry collections Erna Naba Abhiudaya Baladeguladali Dayava Prathvi Kannada Sahitya Academy Award Samudra Jithagalu English words Topic other Sahitya Vimarshaya Kalavu Tatvagalu Nana Jivana Drishti Jivana Padagalu Kala Siddhanta India and World Culture Gokak Kruthi Chintana Pravasa Katanagalu Honours and awards Presidentship of the 40th Kannada Sahitya Samalana in 1958 Honorary doctorates from the Karnatak University Honorary doctorates from the Pacific University of the USA Central Sahitya Akademi Award for his in 1961 Jnanpith Award for his Bharatha Sindhu Rashmi, in 1990 Topic. Translations Voices of the Himalaya, translated by the authors, Kamala Ratnam, V. K. Gokak and others. Bombay, Asia Publishing House, 1966. V. 70 p. Poems by celebrated poet Ramdari Singh Dinkar. Topic. See also Gokak Agitation, a language campaign